We're in Beaver. Beaver. Uh, I haven't done one of these videos in a long time, so I don't really know how to talk to a camera anymore. <laughs> My beautiful girlfriend. It's Miss Marina Mars driving us along. Now we're in Beaver, the place where the best water supposedly exists. I, I've never tried their water here. Maybe we'll try it today. I don't know. We gotta stop for gas soon. We're heading to FitCon. It's gonna be a weird fucking Friday tomorrow. Because people will be putting swords into me and playing tug of war with my face all day. Hey, moose. Moose? Oh, she wants me to show up to Moose. The cows are important to my girlfriend. They're just tiny little black dots out in the field. That's okay. And I can't zoom up on them because of the screen. I mean, well, not the screen, but the window. Schmerk. Good morning, everybody. Today's a crazy day. I'm in Salt Lake, as I've said before, and I'm doing one of the most dangerous things I've ever done today. Something I've actually never done before. And I feel like I say that a lot because usually everything I do is something I haven't done before. Oh, can you see my ass in that marabou man? Right back there? No, the camera's blocking it. Hooray. So, with that being said, I'm naked. I'm about to get some makeup on. I'm a little nervous for today because I could initially kill myself. I could seriously die if one of these stunts goes wrong. What's happening is I'm participating in the Fit Games as one of the challenges for all of these fitness participants. People that have been doing this for a living, literally. So, we're going to play Tug of War. They're going to pull a nail out of my nose and I am going to teach them how to stick a sword in me. It's going to be a crazy, unpredictable day, and I'm so ready for it. I'm honestly ready to see the looks on these bodybuilders' faces and see what the fuck their reactions are like, and if they can actually follow through with learning how to stick a sword in somebody, because for people I've worked with in Cirque, it was difficult for them to learn, especially people who didn't like the sounds of the gag reflex or other nasty-ass noises I would make when, uh... <laughs> when showing them what I could do. So, with that being said, enjoy this vlog, enjoy the video. Please like, share, comment, all that jazz because I work so hard to try and bring you guys content. I've even got my new gimbal and it has been a pain in the ass to try and figure out and work and it's just a lot of learning curve because I'm not in the professional film industry, okay? I do all this to bring you guys a glimpse into my weird fucking life, okay? So I hope you enjoy it and uh, yeah, stay tuned for the weirdness. Here we go to FitCon. It's gonna be weird because of masks all day and other stuff. Ah, look at this cutie. Ah, you ready, babe? I'm ready. I'm ready too. I can take this thing off until we get to the actual. Oh, face mask life. Fifteen kilograms. That's two hundred and fifty-three point five pounds for a new no. national record. Come on, let's get behind her. Let's make some noise. Let's see get it, girl! Becca's going for it. Come on, Becca. Three, two, five. You got this. Yeah! Damn. So, how many of you have seen a live freak show? Raise your hands. Anybody? Well, maybe you've seen me at FearCon in 2018, but uh, I was performing dangerous feats like this. Let me show you. Here, folks, we have a 17-inch solid steel blade. It is a crisp blade with lots of waves. I love this guy's face right now. He is not ready for what is about to happen. So, 
all of our participants here on stage are competing in the FitCon Fear Games. What will be happening? They will be taking on three different challenges against me, to where it will test their willpower and their ability to deal with fear and grossness in the moment. Does that sound exciting? <laughs> Folks, I'm about to swallow this sword all the way down and do some push-ups with it, just to get the show warmed up and started. Are you ready, FitCon? <laughs> So this first challenge, I'm going to get a little hammered with each one of my contestants. We're going to be going one at a time down the line. It's a really simple task. All they're going to be doing is pulling a very large nail out of my nose after I hammer it all the way back. We're going to start all the way at this end. No, 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 don't be shy. Don't move around. I can tell everyone's getting a little flustered. Should we do it, guys? Should we push their boundaries? All right, I love it. I'm getting hammered. No, I'm doing all the work here. He just has to pull out. When I yell freak, you yell show! Freak! Show! Freak! Show! Alright, just the tip, okay? Just the tip. See, that wasn't so bad, right? Alright, I'm gonna get hammered while she composes herself. Freak! Show! She did it so fast! Oh, wait till we step it up to level two, folks. in front is really messed up in the head right now. It not only goes one way, but it does go in reverse, too. Now, what we're going to be playing, we're playing tug of war. Except I'm going to be doing all of the pulling. Looks like I won that 
around. Make some noise, folks! <laughs> down. We have one against five right now, folks. I'm still winning. I thought I had it, but man, he's got those muscles. Get that iron grip. In just five minutes, you'll see it all here on stage. You will be putting a sword within me. I will be swallowing the sword without any hands on it. It's gonna be dangerous. Mind you, I did this in Las Vegas for the Cirque du Soleil show run that recently closed. I had a sword hammered in me multiple times a night. So I know I can take on these guys. Are you ready, Vidgon? Stop, don't, 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 don't,
Okay. I've never been to the hospital doing what I do. That should say a lot. <laughs> Two. One more, and then he does it on his own. Let's go, let's go. I think he's ready, folks! Are you making some noise?
games you expected, but that's what you got today. I hope you enjoyed. My name is Ozzy Blood. We've sure given you a show today that you did not expect. Please give it up for all your fitness influencers! Yeah! Yeah, for the free! Yeah! And again, thank you all for having me out here to Fit Town. I hope you enjoyed our little spectacle today. You probably won't see it ever again anywhere else, so... We have a show that post on social media. Just tag me, A-U-Z-Z-Y Blood. Stay brutal, my freaky friends, and enjoy the rest of your evening. Good night! Yeah. Wait, hold on. Do you want to see me do one crazier thing? Yeah. I can't hear you. Yeah. All right. Mind you, I used to do this in the surf show. It's crazy. show for today, folks. I'll see you around. Have a good night. Blue boy. I had no idea what was going to happen, but that went smoother than ever expected. Just because I felt I had all the control. I felt I was in a classroom of buff little children who were scared out of their minds about what the teacher was going to do. It was amazing. It was fun. It was incredible. I think I changed some people's lives and perspectives today on a whole other level. And uh, I'm just high off adrenaline like crazy right now. So it's fun. I, I figured a bunch of the bigger guys were gonna back out like they did. And that's what happened. I had full control today. And mentally, obviously we know the willpower of uh, these strong people. They have a willpower for fitness, but for fear, no. And that's what I love most, is just showing people that once you step outside your boundaries, you know nothing! Well, it's been a day for sure. What a day at VidCon. Holy hell. Fitness influencers were amazing, even though you guys are scared shitless. It was a beautiful day. Thank you, VidCon, for having me out. We're gonna head back to our Las Vegas home, and uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Whatever the fuck this video was, I don't know. I didn't record anything. I'm just here behind the camera. Remember, folks, you can accomplish anything you put your mind to. Don't forget that. That's what I'm here to show you. And this, let all the anxiety and fear fade away. Immerse yourself in new and exciting situations and just see what happens. If some bad happens, learn from it. If some good happens, use it as a catalyst. Use it as a catalyst to inspire yourself. Anything's possible. I'll see you next time.